Good evening. Glad you're with us tonight. A scuffle between first responders is caught on tape. Highway Patrol troopers and a paramedic nearly come to blows while a patient was being taken to the hospital. Dave Jordan shows us the tape and possible charges for the paramedic. Well, Amy, OHP alleges that one of the paramedics you're about to see on video assaulted an OHP trooper. Now, that alleged assault is not on this tape, but the man who shot this video says all of this could have been avoided if troopers acted differently. You are under arrest. Okay. You are under arrest. I'll get in there. The video is as disturbing as it is shocking. Two first responders scuffling in the street while a patient awaits treatment for heat exhaustion. Hey, and we're like telling this dude, like, man, my mom is in the back, man. My stepdad's like, man, my wife is back here. Can you do this at the hospital? Kenyatta Davis, the son of the woman being transported, shot this video of the heated argument. He says it all started because the ambulance failed to yield to OHP troopers who were en route to a call along Highway 62 in Payton. But Kenyatta says the driver of the ambulance was trying to avoid hitting a car that slowed down and wasn't aware of troopers nearby until it was too late. He slowed down and as the car was getting over, that's when he passed us and we did, I didn't hear him. But after OHP troopers finished their official business, they pulled the Creek Nation ambulance over. You can hear one of the troopers chiding Paul for failing to yield. I've been going hot over here to help the county out, you understand? Yes, I do. Once the ambulance was pulled over, Kenyatta pulled out his phone and shot video of the scene. The trooper goes over to arrest the paramedic who was treating Kenyatta's mother. OHP says he assaulted one of the troopers before this incident happened, and that's when this struggle ensued. We showed this tape to News 9 legal analyst and former police officer Irvin Box. It didn't look like it was being handled very well, at least from the, stand, the tape I saw from the trooper's standpoint. Um, it's something if he had done something earlier, it's something maybe could have been handled after the, the patient was transported. Now, OHP allowed the ambulance to continue on to the hospital without arresting the paramedic, and the entire scene, including the alleged assault, was captured on dash cam video but has not been released. The Okfuskie County DA's office is reviewing all of the footage and could file criminal charges against the paramedic by the end of the week. Amy? All right, Dave, and the Highway Patrol will not comment specifically on either video because it is being reviewed by prosecutors. By the way, Kenyatta's mother was treated and released.